Hello, hello everyone, the stream is starting. How is everyone today? Hopefully doing well. Oh, Baldur's Gate, how oh, I love you. I'm happy to be here. I'm always happy to be playing Baldur's Gate. I play far too much of this game. I'm trying to not burn out on it, but we'll, we'll see how well I do on that. <laughs> so! For those who don't know me, I'm Black Cat. I like to do lots of dungeon crawler content and RPG and sometimes shooters and all that sort of weird shit. Last weekend, we finished up uh, on the YouTube channel at Black Cat Studio on YouTube, which is where YouTube channels are, yes, uh, with our Dead Rising 2 series. It ended up totaling 20 episodes, and it was very, very good. I had a lot of fun playing that game. And it's not necessarily the end of playing that game either. We might still play more. And there's more games to, to come. So, we'll see how that goes. So, last time we played Baldur's Gate, we did a little bit of murder. Not really as much evil as you would expect, but some evil. L little, a tiny bit of evil. We had a little bit of evil uh, as a treat. Just as a little cat treat. So, we are Lilith. Yeah, uh, why do I want to call her Dark Shroud? Not right. Is that right? What is. Oh, I can't want to say Night Song because of the Look for the Night Song quest. That's why I'm confused. <clears throat> I organized my people a little bit. Usually I would, would have sold all the shit I needed to sell before this the stream started, but, uh, I ran into a little issue with, uh, with doing that. Yeah. Yeah. You'll see in a second what the issue was that I had with selling shit. Uh, well, mainly that it's nighttime right now. Is is that's that's the that's main issue. But let's let's go to sleep. I'll just select. Ooh, there we go. You don't sleep well, flitting between dreams and nightmares. Maybe you wake up because you know something is wrong. Or maybe you just get lucky. Shit. No, no. It's not what it looks like. I swear. I... I wasn't going to hurt you. I... I just needed... Well... Blood. There, in the dim firelight, you see him for what he really is. A vampire. A slave to sanguine hunger. We should have known this for quite a while. Uh... <laughs> quite a while. Oh. What just happened? Come on. Oh, Discord is now freaking out. That's not good. Discord. Come on. Oh, now you're good. Cool. So we should have known this for a while, but the thing is, I tend to make my uh, characters uh, go for a long amount of time before they actually sleep. And that has resulted in me... Uh... <laughs> having, uh... Having some issues where I'm not actually seeing a lot of the stuff that... Uh, I normally would earlier because I'm just being too efficient. <laughs> okay. Uh, also, one second, everyone. Okay, and my avatar is fixed. Good. So. I don't like my options here because the first one is how long have you. How long since you killed someone? Days? Hours? Oh, that's rich, Lilith. That is rich. You have fucking murdered so many people. You are a mass murderer, and you dare accuse someone of having killed this week? Come on. You know when he last killed. It was when he killed beside you with the druids. You murdered so many druids yesterday. You know when that happened. Also, I'm not going to fucking stake him. Who cares? I don't care he's a vampire. But I guess I'll take the stupid option because I mean I don't want to I don't want to attack him. I've never killed anyone. Well, not for food. 
feed on animals. Bulls, deer, kobolds. Whatever I can get. But it's not enough. Not if I have to fight. I feel so... weak. If I just had a little blood, I could think clearer. Fight better. Please. A strange sensation courses through you, and your companion's mind unfolds, secrets half revealed. Okay. Why didn't you tell me? I don't care how much you need. You're not drinking my blood. Push into his mind searching for truth. Well, he's going to be very mad at me if I push into his mind. I'll just say, why didn't you tell me? At best, I was sure you'd say no. More likely, you'd ram a stake through my ribs. No. I needed you to trust me. And you can trust me. I do, I do believe you. you Try to bite me. How can I trust you? Leave if, if if I ever see you again, I'll kill you. I mean, he did try to bite me without consent. Because we don't have a choice. Not if we're going to save ourselves from these worms. I need you alive. You need me strong. Please. Only be a taste, I swear. I'll be well, you'll be fine. And everything can go back to normal. Uh, okay. Now I think we're moving a bit better in, in a better direction now. Because I, I think Lilith wouldn't necessarily be against this. Uh, I'm trying to decide whether it's like find not more not a drop more than you need, or all right, but go too far and I'll drive a stake through your chest. I think I'll take the second one just because my trust with him has been broken a little bit by him trying to bite me. <laughs> ah, of course. I shall be gentle as a babe. Let's make ourselves comfortable, shall we? It's like a shard of ice into your neck. A quick, sharp pain that fades to throbbing numbness. Your breath catches. Your pulse quickens. Hmm. Grab the stake into Tuna's heart. No. Uh, honestly, I feel like she would like pain, so I'm going to let him go you. Lean into him, losing yourself. You can feel your blood racing, coursing through both your bodies. A gentle, numb feeling starts to spread. Ah, uh, no. You're taking too much now. Ah, oh, fuck! Ah, uh, shit. Um, I don't want him to kill me, so I'm gonna reroll this. And I do worry he's gonna kill me accidentally. Uh, of course. I was just swept up in the moment. Hmm. But it worked. I feel good. Strong. Happy. At least I might get a buff for this. Well, stop trying to make me kill him. I don't want to kill him. You did almost just kill me. It feels like. But I didn't. <laughs> and that's what matters. Oh my god, Astarian. We've gained. Together, we can take on the world. You better have a fucking buff after this. Uh... I hope so. I look forward to seeing you fight. Shouldn't take long. So many people need killing. True. Now, if you'll excuse me, you're invigorating, but I need something more filling. This is a gift, you know. I won't forget it. You watch as he yeah. stalks towards the forest, stronger, more confident, ready to hunt. I got the achievement just the nibble. Yeah, I was going to actually, like, sell shit 
during uh, during the day like I usually would. Uh, but uh, yeah, I noticed that happening, so I immediately reloaded uh, so that I could do that all with, with all of y'all instead of on my own. Also, hi Ron! I didn't want to interrupt the sequence. But hi Ron! Okay, what do you have to say now, Astarian? Good morning. How do you feel? Probably drained. My neck hurts, how do you think I feel? Uh, I'm fine, just a little woozy. It'll pass. Just be glad I'm not a true vampire. A bite from them and you might wake up as a vampire spawn. Like my good self. All of a vampire's hunger, but few of their powers. Is that how you can stand being the sun because you're not a true vampire? Any other drawbacks I should know about? Pity, I thought you'd be more powerful. Um... I say, is that how you can stand in the sun? Oh no. I should be cinders in this light. I hadn't seen the sun for 200 years before we crashed here. Someone, or something, wants me alive. They've changed, changed the, rules. the rules. Standing in the sun, wading through a river, wandering into homes without an invitation. They're all perfectly mundane activities <clears throat> now. As for my other quirks, well, <laughs> we can figure those out in time. What's that mean? <laughs> okay, what's causing this? The Mind Flayer's Parasite? Figure them out quickly, I don't want any more surprise. Yeah, I don't want any more surprises. No more surprises. You have my word. What a fucking up your word. I'm you're being sensible about these uh, revelations. I was worried people might turn up with torches and pitchforks. Would have been more sensible if you fucking Although told me. There's still time. Oh God, Will's here. Care among us. So be it. But should I wake with so much as a drop of blood on my neck, I will end him. That's fair. I'd just better not wake in the night to find fangs at my throat. Uh. Okay, I don't trust him. I will never. There's no reason to trust him. He's not trustworthy, nor am I trustworthy, for that matter. Uh, enough. We need him. She's not wrong. We're bound together, no matter what comes. We need his Maybe dumb pasty ass. Dissuade any nighttime prowl. <laughs> there now, we're all friends again. She Shall would look you with a collar. There's a long day ahead of us. Okay, anyone else? Anyone feel like murdering Astarian, or are we good? Something's on my mind. Speak. Uh, nope. I Stop giving me ways to say I didn't kill Alfira. I admitted to it. Well met. Now, literally no one have anything else to say besides that? Like, oh, okay, I guess he's a vampire. Oh, happy. Sarian's vampire hunger has been temporarily sated. Plus one dual attack roll, saving throw, and most ability checks. I'm bloodless, feeling woozy. Okay. Can't afford to stay idle. So I did actually do something between our sessions. So that's kind of interesting. I have respect Shadowheart. So she initially is is a trickery domain cleric. So she has like illusion magic and stuff. Now she is life domain. So she is mainly more into healing and such. That also gives me this, which is just heals twelve health to everyone, or for free, just on channel divinity, which is great. Before I had to use a level two spell slot for that. And you only recover those at the end of the day. Also, lesser restoration. I'm gonna see if this works. Yep, I'm not bloodless anymore. Good. Didn't really want to be. I didn't really want to have any issues there. Okay, so let us. 
go out to places. Oh, uh, best place. Uh, I do actually want to go back to the grove and sell some stuff off quickly. Let's try this way. Oh, you're not the right, right. person to lead. What now? I want my lead. PC to lead. My player character. Feed if you must, Astarian. I re. Yes, yes, yes. You've already said that, Lysel. I wish that the the fucking uh, waypoint was inside the grove, so I don't have to walk through the stupid portcullis every time. Bet that will fit in my pack. Okay, Aaron. Need anything else? Of course. Where's... Shut up, I don't care. Oh, you don't have enough money. Uh, yeah, I guess that's fair. Okay, well, read all that. But he is so much crap just for me. <laughs> Look at all the light leather chest plates that I've given him from all the dead druids. <laughs> oh, so many druids murdered. A little time. Okay, he has 12 more gold. What can I sell? And it's... Okay, two gold left. Sell. And that's just about it. Okay, and that is all the money that I could possibly get from him. Oh, enough waiting. I crave blood. Eh, not as good. I don't think he actually has anything useful, seeing as pretty much everything that he has is stuff I've given him. <laughs> okay. Cool. Well, you're devoid of money now. Uh... What's your face? Bannon, Jargon, Jammin. Uh, what? What's the fuck? Uh, Damon. Okay, that's why I was thinking a Bannon. I was thinking Bannon because path, but Damon. Looking for steel. I have, well, something close. Okay, that's all the rest of my crap. Balance offer. Harder. Okay, is there anything he has that I want? He's a shield, plus one to saving throws. Hmm, snaring strikes better. Damn, now. One less slashing damage is probably not enough to. Justify 300 gold. Ring mail, padded armor. Uh, padded armor. Yeah, I would would have preferred to do this not during stream. I would have I tried to do this off stream, but. Oh, I already have padded armor. Okay, so I'll get that for a Starian. And... What else? Warhammer, don't need a spear, great sword. Uh, you're using sword, right? Yeah, you're good. I also have a heavy crossbow, which she could use, but she has Gadriel's Aspiration. Uh, I think every... Good. Yeah, that should be good. Watch your back. Oh. 
No, oh, but I mean, that's one more AC to uh, Astarian plus, and one less slashing damage he can take, so that's good. Plus, we cleared everything else out. Makes me happy. Talk to Zoru. Oh. I don't remember this quest, but if I need to talk to him, we'll talk to him. By Mordai's eyes, another one. Mm. My friend's blood not enough. Come to rip me open too. In Kresh Kalir, a formal greeting begins with a bow. Oh, you're such a bitch. Is this monster with you? Ah. Uh. Hmm. Now, uh. Hmm. Ah. Eh. I'll torture him a little bit. Ah, <laughs> oh, I'm an asshole. <laughs> On your knees. I don't care if you disapprove Shadow Heart. <laughs> You saw another gith. Where? On the road, to Baldur's Gate. N near the mountain pass. S saw us, for we saw it. Jammed its blade through Yul's belly. Straight to the other side. No twisting. Kin must have been in a hurry. Oh, she's Come such on. an evil fuck. Show me. You can keep your innards. Aw, but they sell. Oh, you're not going to eviscerate him. I was hoping for a show. Call your blood. I'll indulge you soon enough. I make a good pair. And again. Swing and swing and God, deliver me. Okay. Well, we did that. Uh, Lizelle, you said you, you had something to talk about? Uh, is it just me, or are you even looking at me differently? I have a confession. Oh? I was too hasty to judge you. I thought you witless, gutless, unimpressively bland. Thanks. <laughs> I thought you cruel, stubborn, and judgmental. Yes. All that is true. I am cold as the sea of night. But you have stoked fires I didn't know I possessed. I swear, you would tear the horns off one dragon for plunging into another. You've gained my respect, and more still, my yearning. Why don't you horny Welcome post elsewhere? You. Your odor alone is enough to make my neck sweat and my hair stand on end. Uh, she's such an arrogant bitch, though. Uh, would Lilith like her? I mean, okay, she is kind of like a ma- uh, Would the mass murderer like the bloody, cold, ruthless warrior? Probably. Hold on, are you coming on to me? Uh, no, I think she would know better than that. Uh, if you respect me so much, why are you such a prickly grouch? Uh, I think this is just the option to fuck her, basically. Uh, do I? Yeah, she probably would. Yeah, maybe. Uh, I don't think I would say my heart is racing. Uh, I don't think I would say yuck either. Uh, respect me so much, then why are you such a prickly grouch? If sure. you must know, Vlerkith requires everything of her children. I can't count how many bruises I've inflicted. Can't measure how much blood I've drawn in the Undying Queen's name. I know only blood red and death black. My mind is silver and my body steel. I am what I must be. Say what I must be. To survive every beast I face and every wound I bear. Bah, enough talk. I will be plain. I want to taste you. Perhaps tonight, <laughs> I like little this expression. Later, but I want it all the same. Do you? 
Why are you saying this in the middle of the grove? Like, you could have said this last night. Or tonight. Uh, sure thing, I've been wanting a hot Githyanki girlfriend. Uh... Uh... Wait, no, she's gonna hate this because she doesn't want girlfriend, she wants... Fuck. Ah, uh, sure, whatever. Yes. I'll fuck later. Perhaps one night soon... I, <laughs> I thought for a second that was Asterian approves. <laughs> Until that night comes, I shall keep enjoying your scent. Cool. Okay, well, we, um... Oh, uh, hmm. Uh... uh. <laughs> kind of turn that off. <laughs> just, to, just to make sure that if she decides to come around tonight... I won't, uh, encounter- I won't have any issues. Uh, I shall name this Neck Sweat. Cool. So. We have people to murder. We best get through that. Oh, we'll level are we? And we're level four, that's obscene. That is really high for where we are currently, because we haven't even dealt with the absolute forces yet at all. So that's pretty good. I mean, we've already, we've talked to to Ethel already, and we haven't even dealt with in her house, and we haven't even dealt with a lot of shit. Okay, uh, we are going to. Uh, how close are we to leveling? Is it worth it? Now we're fresh right now. I'm gonna go do something else. There is an encounter over here that we can do, but I'm gonna hold off on that until we have less freshness. I don't know, like we're, we're all stacked and ready to go right now. So we might as well go and fight something that's bigger and scarier. Did the night you shared with our friend, Laser. You didn't consider it beneath you. They were beneath me at times, but also above me, <laughs> and standing at certain points. That's enough. I get the picture. Gods, do I get the picture? We didn't fuck yet! Why? What are you talking about? Ah. Uh. Oh, do I want to be an asshole? I could be an asshole. I don't need any attention. Oh, I could be an asshole right now. Oh. Oh, it's so tempting. I show that on stream? Hmm. <laughs> There's something interesting happening uh, elsewhere. And I could go ruin two people's time who are fucking currently. And cuck them real hard. <laughs> no, I don't think Twitch would like that. Fine. They can fucking pace without my character bothering them just for the pure sake of being an asshole. Always room for more. If you want to say that, you'll have to go do it in your own playthrough. Playthroughs, I guess. Bug what? Uh, anything here? Okay. 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 Where am I? What? No. What? Where am I? What do? Okay. Uh, we can leave the bridge alone for a second. Let's we'll see if we can find anything here. Well, and I guess Anne also collect ingredients, too. Uh, is this just back into the town? Yes, it is. Okay. What mug boards for? It might be for health potions. Arca. Loot. 
Annan's handkerchief. Oh, that's... Oh, Cannon's one of the people who died very early on. One of the tieflings. Also, big goblin camp over here. That is something to note. I don't know if there's any way to get over there right now without going through. Actually, no, there definitely is a way to get over there without going through. Uh, we've seen everything I think we can see here without going over the bridge. And I don't really want to go over the bridge yet. Because there is danger over the bridge. We're going to go back to the Blood Village. And we are going to go... Go... North. North. Oh. There is more barrel. I'll give it a Don't shot. care. Okay. No traps, please. Yeah, we're not going in there. As much as I en as I enjoy having my character be an absolute asshole, we will leave the characters to fuck. Let's see. Can I move this? Yes, I can. Wow, that was stupid of me. I'm trying to see if there's anything under it. Nothing under it? Seriously? Get away from the fuckers. Literally. Oh, dagger! Beast fit for an ogre. You notice a peculiar dagger protruding from the tough, leathery meat. Hmm. Uh. Okay, well, I have high strength. Because this is Lysel. Plus guidance. Fifteen. We'll hear them fucking in the background. You yank the dagger free, leaving a narrow slit behind. Let's leave before whoever owns this dagger comes back. Ah, always a good sign when there is an auto save. Wait, what is there? Oh, I know what's going on. Okay, never mind. Okay. Anything else over here I can get before I go? No? Okay. Good. Good, good, good. Oh, what? Why? Please come. Don't. Don't just fuck around. Just. Okay. That dagger that you got, like. Plus one dagger. At least things have stayed Lilith. Trust no one. Well, this is basically the exact same thing. Cool. Whatever. Uh, nope. Still alive, so that's progress. Jump. Want to star in? Yep. Another step forward. Yep. 
Okay, so... Free for the taking. There are... a bunch of hyenas over here. Multiple that are bloated and on the ground, and one that is still moving. We are going to do what we can. Best be on my way. Do something tall right through these people. Kill some of these. But ignore the one that's standing. Kill the at uh, or sorry, yeah, gonna get ignore the one that's standing and kill the one that's on the ground. Okay, they're still locked in place. And because I hit everyone at No! Don't move, Lizelle. You are going to get yourself caught. Okay, and since we're in tune brace mode, they're all locked in place and they can't actually see, despite the fact that I'm right beside them. Finally. Okay, that's two of them down. Mizell, hopefully you have good rain. I want you to shoot at... Dark over that one. Okay, that did not kill it. And the final one... I will bring it up here. So this, this is basically the method that I'm using right now is the method to ensure that you get a full, a surprise round on, like, on everyone, on all your characters by bringing them in one at a time. Specifically triggering combat with one of them only. Well, so much for peace. Okay. Now that all of that has happened. Because my character is an assassin and combat has started now, I now get to take another turn. Despite the fact that I did use my actions anyways. Breathe quiet. I gonna take out this one. Oh fuck! I'm that was a 96% I just missed on. That's not good. Uh, uh oh, no! Oh fuck! Okay, we need to kill that one. <laughs> There's that one on the ground too. Still. Uh, okay, we're gonna move over here, or as we can. We're gonna hide. Oh, right. He is a trickster, not an assassin, so he can't actually go and, uh... Hmm. I don't have a bonus action I besides poison. Okay, I'll do that then. That's unfortunate. Okay, so the reason why I was trying to kill these is that basically gnolls infect hyenas, and after a certain amount of time they transform into a gnoll which are stronger than hyenas, as these hyenas were level 1 with 12 health, and these are level 4 with 20 health. Okay. Might as well just run there-ish. And I will bring out this way. This- oh, that's a melee attack, right. Right, right, right. I could summon a spectral weapon, actually. Trident, spear, I never use it before. All halberd, great sword, great axe. I don't know the difference between any of them. They only last 10 turns. So they last for one fight, then. I think I'd rather not use it. this fight. Uh, we're not, like, in danger right now or anything. We're really not in danger. We will be soon, though. The, the, don't wanna, don't want any uh, miss. Don't want any uh. Incorrect. Oh, fuck! That was stupid of me. One day I'll catch a break. I am in plain sight and decided to do that, and that was dumb. 
uh, tried to hide in plain sight. That's not going to work. Okay, I need to kill this one. Or, oh, it's going to get away, damn it. Oh, no, that's not good. So there's a bunch of other gnolls up here. <laughs> I was trying to get the hyena to die before all those gnolls entered combat. Now I have problems. <laughs> Okay, what should I do here? Let's finish this. Can I kill this knoll with just this? Okay, yes, good. Okay, and I'm gonna keep you right there. We're gonna go into hiding. Oh, you can't hide, okay. Lizelle. Want you. Get the hell over here. Because you are going to block them. Okay, she's threatening this one now. And attack. Cool. Also, so you can see my radius right now. If anything walks into that radius, then it will be considered threatened and it will take an attack of opportunity from her. That does protect... My other people a little bit. Wait. No. That was dumb of me. It was a, that was a real rookie mistake I just made. I need to... Oh, what's my range like? Okay, yeah, my range is okay. So, I just... I guess I'm going to have to make up for my mistake. And I'm going to use my action to dash. Get just barely out of their range that I have not seen any. I'm going to hide. It'll be used once a turn. What? Is this considered the same turn? Used. Okay, whatever. Back! Okay, that went well, and now I will hide him in the bushes. And I'm not going to do anything with her, so she'll wait. And Lilith, hello. Can I get you to attack just from here? Yes, I can. Have made me your enemy. Okay, that one's dead. And because of my ring? Right, uh... Where is it? Okay, because because of my mantle, once per turn, if I kill an enemy, I turn into I turn invisible for two turns. I'm gonna use that time to relocate. There. Ouch! That hurt. One disadvantage of having Lysel tank everything is that Lysel is tanking everything. <laughs> okay, so... Currently... There's basically nowhere for a Starion to hide. So unless he succeeds at a hiding check, I don't really have a chance. So I'm going to have to just straight up fight these guys. Uh, you're going to go over there. That one out. Uh, oh, I am... Because of the hyena disappearing, I am now able to hide because I'm just barely out of their visual range. Okay, and hide. And wait. First, attacks, fails. Attack, fail. Thankfully, they're only level four, so they can't attack twice. Oh, shit. Uh, I've been soul numbed, can't take bonus actions or reactions. That's really bad because thieves need bonus actions to hide. And also he found me, so that means I'm not hiding anymore. It's bad. Okay, what's my best bet? Uh, I should probably hit this one because if I can break his concentration, then I'll be able to hide again. Oh, shit. That did more than just break his concentration. Okay. 
I'm going to second wind to give myself some more health back. And I'm going to stay here. If he tries to move away from me in this next turn, he will die. Okay, what's my best bet? I don't want to go too far in. I am here. Um, I could just straight up kill this one and not worry about it, because he's probably going to turn around and attack my character, since there's no good reason for him to move, because he'll die immediately. Okay, yeah. that's. I think that's for the best. Okay. Lilith, who is visible and therefore able to sneak attack. Hey, hold on a second. With haste. I'm invisible. I don't need to worry about... Uh, a lot of things right now about being seen or anything, so I could just go into, like, this really obvious location and shoot at the ranger. Oh, one shot. <laughs> oh, and, <laughs> and because I killed something this turn, I just got invisibility again. This mantle is stupid good. Holy shit. Uh, I'm going to... I'm going to stay here, actually. I don't have any reason to move. Okay. I can't hide, so my best bet... Wait, actually, I can hide. Dash. I'm going to move out of his vision cone. He's right here, because people in this game have no peripheral vision. I'm going to hide. I'm going to shoot. Done. Yeah, so if you see how much- how I've basically not lost any health, be like, after Lysel's second wind, that kind of shows that we're a little bit overleveled for this. Usually, we wouldn't be doing this well in this particular fight, but we're, we're a bit... I mean, okay. To be fair, we went after the Spider Queen. That was a much bigger opponent first. And now we're coming back and cleaning up for XP's sake. Ooh, longsword. Okay. Up some stuff. I will take my pick. More stuff. Don't need intestines for anything. I don't know why I would want them. Okay. Oh, I didn't get the barrel. Aina that had sunk into the ground. Good. I'm using Lysel. Fascinating. <laughs> I'm using Lysel to uh, pick up things right now because as a strength character, she has the highest carry capacity. So usually I use my main character to do that, but it just it makes more sense to use the highest carry capacity character instead. What am I doing? Eh, she's getting up there and wait. Uh, see if we can get off these notes. One of them probably has a magic weapon. Or not. Oh, there's a severed leg. Fun. Hi. Shouldn't have Lilith. To live in more interesting times. Grew up again? Dreaming red. 
See what else we can find. Maybe I need more pockets. Oh, why? Why save? Oh, this is why. Okay, so there's multiple creatures here. Okay, well, we got another fight here already. That symbol in the blood. What does it mean? Well, there's a fair bit of them. Level fours mainly. I ungroup. Hide over here. They're doing something. What are they doing? Setting themselves on fire from the looks of it. <laughs> okay, well, I'm gonna hide there. Keep your blade close. Gently. Ariana. We're gonna go higher over there. Izel, I want you there. And Shadow Heart, I want you over here. So I'm going to do the line method again, where I start with one character engaging, blocks them all in combat, and then. And then move the rest of my characters into combat slowly. Okay, first things first. Lind, no warlord. 85 health. Oh boy. What is going on over there? Something's happening. But I want to try to kill the warlord first because it's the scariest. I could also go for some of the weaker ones to just knock them out. What is happening? Oh, there's some warriors putting up a fight in there right now, which is why they're burning slowly. Okay. Uh, you know what? I'm going to try to take out something we... No, I can't get advantage on them. Okay. Warlord it is. I'm going to move away from the party so that they don't get caught when I do this. Okay. So everyone is now locked in combat. And we got a surprise, which means that... Uh, I will be able to go this round without them being able to get around. And then I'll be able to go again. Basically, they skip a turn because they're surprised. Okay. Now that they're locked in combat, I can move around freely because their vision cones won't move anymore. Move that way. Now. Okay, not, okay, not that far. I, I don't need to have any who are already in stealth. That was stupid. On the hunt. Okay, well, whatever. I got my damage in almost. I did lose getting a free action there because I used an ability too close to combat. To a combat area. Okay, I'm going to move closer here. And I'm going to use normal attack with her. Ah, missed. That's not good. Okay, she's late in the turn order, so I won't get another attack for a little while. And Shadowheart is the last one. Uh, he's still, still fairly healthy. I am going to try to command grovel him, knock him down. Perfect. Okay, so next turn he has to spend... Next turn he will be down, and the turn after that he has to get up. We'll Nothing take an action. My way. Okay, so I have time to reposition. But that's about it. How Over there. Going? Time to kill. Darian has a second to reposition. Well, and hide. Okay, now the neutral people in here have their turn. Because we got a surprise round for our characters, they also get to be part of the surprise round. 
Oh, they're using alchemist fire to create a fire field on the ground, so if they walk through it, they take damage. Oh. Okay. There's nothing I really can do. I'd stand here beside him. Anything worth doing? Uh... I want to use the Wyvern Poison for this. That would not be worth it. I'll use the Elixir of Bloodlust because there's a lot of things to kill here. And you get 5 temporary HP and an action every time you kill something. Once per turn. Okay, you go there and you're going to hide uh, quietly. The shock of psychic pain, the pack leader's mind clamps onto yours. You see yourself through her eyes, a pulsing red cluster of organs. Feast. No, a voice has forbidden this meat. Noll see your whole world as a meal. This voice is acting as a leash, but it won't hold them for long. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. Authority. Hmm. So this way I can I can force her to obey the voice and run through the fire to attack the people in the cave. I could search her mind for the source of the voice or withdraw and attack imme immediately. Let's search the her mind. A memory. The beast daubs the symbol of the absolute on a cave wall in blood. Very a tadpole struggles to assert control against the ravenous chaos of her mind. Could force her to do something, but I really want to know what's going on. Focus on the tadpole. How did it come to be here? You see drow and goblins restraining her. A mind player reaching out. And then the voice bringing order. Eating this meat was forbidden, but it would lead her to a feast. So basically they use control. Yeah, some sort of command on her via the tadpole to control a mindless beast. Okay. Like either convince her to fight the things in the cave or fight the other gnolls. I would rather have her fight the other gnolls. <laughs> Difficulty 2! <laughs> it's because her intelligence is so low. Or wisdom? Wisdom so low. Sensing your presence, the Knoll's tadpole writhes in ecstasy, echoing your command. Its host will feast on Knoll flesh to control the hunger, to keep her teeth from your throat. Something stirs deep within you, hungry and alert. It's taking something you'll never get back. That's not disturbing at all. Okay. So... She is now on our side. I forgot that I could do that and did not... <laughs> I forgot that I could do that. Did not plan for it. Okay, I can't have disadvantage. Uh, how? Don't waste a Let me step. move over here. I have advantage now. Uh, I'm gonna take out this one. Okay. Now run away. And Starion. Doesn't have an action. Why don't you have an action right now? You didn't have an action last turn either. It's really weird. I'm really confused as to why a Starion is not getting an action. Don't blink. Okay, well, he's gonna hide. That's all he can really do. Uh, 
Uh, build attack multiple times per turn. Uh-oh. So, as of next turn, they'll be able to attack multiple times. That's not good. As long as they maintain concentration. So it gives one turn to attack, and then two. the next turn they have two attacks. Not actually a very good... It's not actually a very good benefit for them. Because they're still getting the same number of attacks. Okay, um, you have gone way too far over here. Not use bonus action soul numbed. Okay. There. Okay, well you're going over there now. Oh. Weird. Uh, I'm gonna stand there so that I can threaten both of these. Oh. Yep, now they're both threatened. Okay, so they won't be able to move without getting attack of without me getting attack of opportunity. Okay. Happy we increased the Star Inn's AC with that new armor, because it seems to be doing work. Ooh, there's a mess of people here. Actually, might be a great chance to use Bane. Up, three, up to three creatures receive a 1d4 penalty to attack rolls and saving throws. Who is not about to die? Uh, target too far. A little closer. One, two, three. Oh, only one of them got baned. The others got through it. Okay, well, you hide up there. Okay, and the Warlord's now on our side. Okay, good. She killed one of them. I am going to... The best bet. Can't hide while being threatened, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. Good fairy fire. Okay, so I've, now everyone who attacks those in the area gets an advantage. Okay, and I'm gonna disengage, get out of here. I'm coming for you. That one can't actually move without taking a uh, attack of opportunity. Though a star is not in a good spot, so I'm going to disengage with him as well. I'm going to run just barely outside their range. Hide. And I'm going to use a sneak attack. Uh, I can hit this one. Uh, that one's going to threaten me next turn. This one is currently being threatened. So I'm going to take out this one first. I probably should have used a elemental arrow so I could do more AoE damage, but whatever. Oh, pushing the acid. Wait, what? Oh, is it because I'm soul numbed? That I couldn't threaten it? Oh. Okay, well no, you're not you're not allowed to to be threatening Shadow Heart. That's not how this works. Okay. Okay, I'm going to brace to deal a bit of extra damage. Attack. And just because I'm slightly worried about Astarian, I will second wind him, or not, or rally him so he'll get some temp HP. Go, and then I get to move Shadowheart. Okay, Shadowheart, you need to get out of the way of this. Uh, though it uses her action to disengage. Can I kill them? Yes, I can probably kill them. If I'm careful. Okay, I'm going to push. I can. Yep, good. I'm going to... Attack. 
Okay, I uh, did nothing. And back off here. Thank you, Flynn. That's actually really useful. Okay, we are still in range of people. Move just out of sight lines. That one's facing away for some reason. What's up with that? Hide. And shoot. In. Okay, you... You're being threatened by that height. Whatever. Disengage, since he has two bonus actions. Move here. Hide. Sneak attack. Oh, that's not good. And turn. You did do something for that one. Though it's killing Flint, which is not a big deal. I don't... Though I should probably see if I can get the last hit on Flint for the XP. Unless I get the XP anyways, I don't know. Uh, who's gonna move? They're gonna move next. Okay. In that case, let's remove them from the turn order. Cool. Oh, and I get a bonus action because of the uh, temporary hit points. For, or, sorry, of the Elixir Bloodlust. And attack. Cool. I will go and jump over the acid and threaten this thing. Okay, Shadowheart, I need you to get the last hit on... Actually, I know that they have a low... Now, they probably have decent decks, so I want them to do an int save. Firebolt. Oh, one damage! No! <laughs> Damn it. Okay, well, you can hide there. Oh my gosh. Okay, Flind is... Flind's on the move. I probably should be worried, but... No, I guess there's no but to that. I should probably be worried. <laughs> uh, Okay, well, I'm just going to shoot this. I don't even need Sneak to deal extra damage. She is still ravenous. Her mind a hungry pit. The flesh of her pack wasn't enough to satisfy her. Okay. Oh. Dominate her mind, command her to feast on herself. Exert your mental power, command her to leave. Uh. I mean, if I fail this, I fight her. And if I fight her, I fight her. So I might as well just try to get her to eat herself. Which is a gruesome thing, I might add. Her tadpole responds, thrashing violently, and the fragile tissue of her brain tears and splits. You taste the blood in her throat. No, nope, I'm good. The cavity of her skull. Holy shit! Just downed. <laughs> oh no! Just downed Liza like that. Oh, no, that's not good. Okay. Hide. Probably kill her in one shot. Yep. Okay, good. Oh, boy. Okay. Help. 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 By the gods. You're a sweet... This isn't convenient. Are any of my crew still alive out there? No, it's a grim sight. This whole journey's been one grim sight after another. Knolls, goblins, drow. Risen Rose I'm a drow. Fuck you. Ever. You're the first friendly face we've seen since Eltergard. I'll stay friendly so long as you hand over your goods. Wait, I can trade with him. Oh, he has money. An alchemist fire.
random shit can I sell? I will take all of that. Nom, nom, nom. Oh, I don't want the bottle. Okay. Uh, hmm, I want him to hand over all his goods, though what I could do is I could just let go out of combat and stab him in the back. Because if he hands over all his goods and leaves, then I risk the chance of of getting in trouble later if he comes back. Where are you heading? We're bound for Baldur's Gate. Got some cargo to deliver. But we've a stop to make along the way. Maybe I should come. See you don't get waylaid again. Thanks, but that won't be necessary. We'll find help at Joaquin's rest. Listen, you look like you know how to handle yourself. You should meet my associates. We've got our own drinking spot by the tavern. Invitation only. Tell the fellow on the door. Little serpent, long shadow. He'll take good care of you. That's useful. What's in the chest, your cargo? Aye, the whole reason we're in this mess. Trinkets for some rich tosser in Baldur's Gate. He gets his shiny baubles. We get a handful of Terenths. Terenths? Much money? The currency of the oh. Zentarim, a network of merchants and mercenaries with few scruples. Mm -hmm. Is Lysel, like, dying on the ground right now? She might be. A lot of people died for those baubles. Rich men place more value on wine and fine clothes than on the lives of folks like me. It's a pretty bit of frippery that'll sit on a mantle gathering dust. But the pay for delivering it makes the risk worthwhile. There. You're Zentrim. Your people don't deal in baubles. You know who we are. Very clever. And you probably also know it's not smart to interfere with Zent business. This is the point when a clever lass like you accepts my gratitude and walks away. Oh! What if the cargo lost, we can sell it ourselves. No, I would rather get in with the Zen term instead. I'm just gonna leave. Okay, and get Lysel up. Okay, so I have a plan. Better be cautious. Okay, turn based mode. I'm only going to get one attack. So I have to pick which one of these I want. Ollie's at 9 health. This one's 28. So they're the big concern right now. Should mind my step. I'm going to move her over here. Time for a little dip. I'm going to move a star in right behind this one. And get Lysel the hell out of the way. And she's like next to dead. Cloak and dagger, my favorite. I'm going to get Shadow Heart over here. Better tread carefully. Keeping low. To block the ladder. Can't get hurt. Okay, and here's what we're gonna do. Ah, oh, fuck, I missed. That's not good. Okay. Well, that's fine. Hide. Sneak attack. Okay. Starion. 
hide and stab in the back. Yep, good. Now I'm going to put a star in on the opposite side of him so that regardless which way he turns, one of us will be able to ambush him. Oh, that was weird. Why did he shoot for the strong box? The strong box is really tough. <laughs> be awfully hard for him to damage that. Oh, Lazel's turn. Are you gonna attack? You might as well. Alright, now she very hide. Got to focus. And range attack, 45% chance to hit. 40% chance to hit with Fireball, and 40% chance to hit with Sacred Flame. Range attack it is. Okay, good. We just got a lot of XP for that. No, no, Lysel, don't, don't, no, don't step in the fire, Lysel, you'll die. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, Shadow Heart. Surf life. Yay! And since I have the the amulet that means when I get healed, I get poison. I now have poison on my weapon. Yay! <laughs> oh, we also got blessed and warded for a turn. Wow. Blessed means we deal more damage and have better rolls or saving throws, and warded means we take half damage from non-elemental. That's really, really good. Okay, cool. Time to loot all of this shit. No, no, hold on. Um, time to heal Lysel. Okay, and Lysel can take a potion too. Cool. Two potions. I have such a headache. Okay, let's see about this caravan strong box. I'm gonna have Lysel pick it up. How much weight does she have? Okay, so she can't really carry a huge amount more. Oh, it's because she has a fire wine barrel and an oil barrel on her. Uh, drop the oil barrel. Fire wine barrel. I didn't realize she had two barrels on her. And rocks. <laughs> Also rocks. Without delay. That's why she's so heavy. Okay, Rugen. And a nice bit of gold. No? I think I got my bloodstone back. I sold. Could be wrong. But I also liquidated like all the sh random shit I had and still gave me gold. That might have been a mistake. I don't know. No, 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 not that. I didn't mean to do that. Okay. Everyone is on oil. That's not safe. Where am I? Everyone out of out of the oil slick. Or it explodes and something bad happens. Okay. Let us actually loot things. We've looted nothing so far. Wait. Uh, a bunch of this is still on fire. Still a volt of fire. Let's loot Flint. The Flint has a special flail that I probably will not use. Hitting an enemy with this weapon heals the wielder for 1 to 6 health. Very good. But they go mad if they don't continue hitting an enemy each turn. Uh, which makes them hostile to everyone in the vicinity. <laughs> kind of terrifying. They also have a Mind Flare Parasite Specimen, if we want to uh, use that to investigate the Mind Flares. Uh, oh, wait. Whoa, what was that? Speedy Reply Scimitar. Wielder hits an enemy with an attack. They gain momentum for two turns. Ooh. 
Honestly, I've been wanting to change Lizelle away from being a Glaive wielder over to being Sword and Shield so she can be a better tank for the party since she is my only tank. So having a sword that's good now will probably help. I just need a shield, though I might go get that plus one shield from uh, Damon. Grove. That's the other option. I won't. Uh, I will do that off stream though, because it'll take a moment for me to go through all the shit that is involved in respecting a character. Lots of stuff. This just... This is... Okay, that didn't anywhere. However, if I remember correctly, yep, there is a ancient sigil there. Means waypoint! Yay, waypoint. Always good to see it. Okay. Now, back to what everyone else is doing. Let us look around this cave a bit. We will meet up with Lysel momentarily. More for me. Oh. Relax, Zach. Make some light. I wish you could just drag things out of your inventory you want to drop. That would be nice. I need to stop picking up rotten carrots. Backpack. Oh. Backpack. Oh, I don't want the bucket. Oh. There is a mine there. Poison mine. Disarm that. Okay, well, you can reach by removing this from your life. That is how you reach. Disarm. Okay, is this chest bugged? No. Off pick. Time should do it. Eighteen. Nice. And we have. Ooh, rage gloves. When the wearer chooses to end their rage, they gain fifteen temporary health. Those are good gloves, depending how you use. Them. Still some more stuff over. like a rum smuggler's cave. I'll pick. Thirteen. Nineteen. Okay. Goal and a fire arrow. Okay, not going that way. Cool. That is this part of the cave looted. Can you please tell me you can jump up there. Uh oh. Ooh. Please tell me you can get back. Go over here. I mean, worse comes to worse, I can teleport. Fast travel, but. Yep. Unfortunately, that's what you'll have to do. Bell is now over here. With a lift. Darian! And Shadowheart. Wait, that put all of them together? Are they... 
going to walk in place? Didn't really want to do that. Can I group just two people? Yes, I can. Perfect. Okay, I didn't know that. Oh, more stuff. More stuff. Oof. Jeez. Basket. I'll just help myself. Uh -huh. Starion really does not have much gear right now. I need to fix that. Because he has... All of his weapons are just basic shit. He doesn't have boots. He does. He has a shitty helmet, and he has no boots. So usually you don't have rings till much later anyway. So, not abnormal. Fire wine girl. This place is a bit rigged below, unfortunately. Ought to be kind of careful. Yep. Shoot this, will that help me? I'm just gonna have to hope for the best. If there's a trap, he'll see it. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> it fucking flattened Shadow Heart. Oh no. I got Indiana Jones. Aww. That hurt. I didn't notice the trap. <laughs> I didn't notice the trap fast enough. Okay. Everyone go go hang out over here, please. Okay, everyone together now. <laughs> I'm ready. Whatever it takes. Okay, I can't use divinity right now. A short rest, but you know what? I'll short rest now. Why not? Oh, that helped. Okay, and I will cure wounds on Shadow Hearts. I will aid on all of them. All of them, right? Yeah. Gives everyone five health and five extra max health. Looks like it claims some victims as well. Ooh. Rival. Just. Oh, not that. Ah, more null problems. Oh. No. 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 I see him carrying a spear. Why can't I have the spear? A lot of viscera around here. What's going on here? Hello, friends. You're welcome to rest here. Everything is clear. Moving in. Why does it sound like the screams of the damned in here? Hello, Anders. Who, who's there? Please, keep your distance. You're welcome to shelter here, but we've grave injuries to tend to. Who's injured? Who or what attacked the you? The devil. The most deadly foe we've yet encountered. We are paladins of Tyr, Lord of Justice. He sent us after an infernal being, straight out of the Nine Hells, hiding in the form of a one-horned tiefling. She slaughtered countless refugees fleeing the Absolute. Yesterday, she butchered an entire family without mercy. We were lucky to survive our encounter with her. Hmm. All the religion encounter, that's important. I can trade with him? Or a long sword or an apple. No, I think I'm good. 
Now that she softened you up, we'll finish you off. No, I'm not going to say that. Wish you and yours well, but I must be on my way soon. Let me help. I can hunt down this monster, or where is this devil? She ran toward the river when she saw we were merely wounded, not dead. Down the hill from here. She must pay for her crimes. If you capture her, you will have served Tyr where we could not. This is the sword of justice, blessed by Tyr. I've wielded it since I swore my oath. It's all I have, but it's yours if you stop her. Bring me her head, and Tyr will consider her crimes repaid. I want cool sword. Uh, I'll think about May it. May the just God guide you. Seems simple enough. Okay. I pack. Oh, none of this stuff is. None of this stuff is protected, despite the fact that this is their place. Usually in someone's house. They care when you steal things. Tieflings don't care when you steal from the grove because they don't care about the grove. The druids do, though. But usually people care when you walk into their house and, like, steal all their stuff. But none of these people don't for some reason. This is weird. So much stuff. I get. Oh, more burlap sacks. Back. Another one there. I think this old coin's upstairs. I. I'll come back to this in a second. So, I have a plan. So, what do you have on you? Lots of spears, that's... Well, so on. Okay. Okay, cool. We're gonna go back to... to the camp first. We're gonna do something. Okay. I wonder what the next move is. Shadow Heart, you're the nicest one in the group. Right? Good. I have a plan. An evil said. plan. Well met. Like you to join me. I'd love to join, but I don't think there's enough space for me to squeeze we'll in. Take Shadow Heart's Ready place. Where am I needed? I'll I'll level you up later, don't worry. Don't worry your pretty little head about that. I two steps at a time. <laughs> oh, I should. <laughs> Well, you can come with us. Wretched thing. I'm definitely not going to do anything evil to you. Our <laughs> lack. Uh -huh, uh -huh. camp. Will has been complaining for a little bit. He has. Wonder if the gods are watching. He really has a lot of. Annoying things about him, morals and decency, all of that. That's that's kind of a problem for Lilith. He gets in the way. just for the sake of it. I have performed deeds well and efficiently. Is this what you mean? Mm, not exactly, but you answered my question. Oh, clock on tape. The key. I wonder what it opens. I still have no idea. Huh? 
Hi, Carlac. Defender of the people. Bill, you go first. Go say hi to Carlac. One horn, the stink of Avernus. Why do you have a sword on your back? You don't have a sword. Diaboli. <sighs> well, I'll be God's damned. The Blade of Frontiers. Thought I'd shaken you for good. That'll teach me to underestimate you. Hmm. You're the devil we've been hunting. Carlac, right? Bloody right. An honor to be chased by the Blade of Frontiers. But I... Ugh! A great heat roars through you. Her heat, fiery as the hells. Then you're lost in visions of demonic armies as you tear through a landscape of fire and blood. The blood war. You saw it from above as the Nautiloid passed through Avernus. This woman was on the front line. What was that? Evidence. Proof that you're a devil. A gladiator in the Archdevil Zariel's army. I can explain. Wait. But it's a whole situation. He had a long sword on his back. Another vision. Karlak's blade okay, rays wait. slicing through devils. Zariel's servants as her eyes dart around seeking escape. Her rage and desperation seep into you. She is a victim of the blood war. Not an agent of it. She's trying to trick us. Don't believe her lies. You saw the truth. I never wanted to serve Zariel. I was enlisted in her army against my will. Forced to fight, and fight I did. When I saw an opportunity to get away, I took it. Finally home. Or near it, anyway. You served her. That's enough to damn you. Hmm. Be practical. She's infected with us. S same as us and powerful too. Stand down, Will. You saw what I saw. I'll, I'll going to tell him to stand down. You don't know what you're saying. You're asking me to trust a devil. Hmm. Gosh, you're stubborn. Carlac's not a devil, and you know it. Yazara thought she poses no danger to the Sword Coast. You know monsters, right? Better than anyone. Look into my eyes. Can't you see I'm not what you think? Shit. You really are no devil, are you? I've... I've been deceived. Oh, thank the gods. Thought I was gonna have to take your head. <laughs> you would have died in the attempt. I wanted but you to. Been enough threats today. Truce then, eh? Aye, truce. I'm Karlak, but you already knew that. And you are. <laughs> I'm not interested in making friends. <laughs> no, uh, I will introduce myself. I'm Lilith. Well met, soldier. Nice to meet a friendly around here. It's been tough going so far. I may not be a devil, but I can put the Blade's reputation to work. How would you feel about helping me kill some evil bastards? Little background, if your moral compass needs something to point at. You already know I fought in the Blood War. I was good. Really good. It turns out I've got a knack for killing demons. That made me a valuable asset. Zariel, the archdevil herself, made me as her personal attack dog. I played along until I could get the fuck out of there. But devils don't like to lose their assets. <laughs> Zariel liked it so little. She sent a bunch of goons, so-called paladins of tears, to take me back. Problem is, I'm not going. Murder time! Let's send them back where they came from. Fuck yes! They cornered me outside the toll house just up the hill. Doubt they've gone far after the scorching I gave them. Then we can work on evicting this parasite and take Faerun by their short hairs. Sound good? 
A warrior who winks at her foes while she slays them. You'd be a fool to refuse her. I agree. Sounds like a great plan. I'd hug you if it wouldn't scorch your skin off. Looks like your troops all trooped up. You'll need to send someone packing if you want me to join. Well. All right. Excellent. See, I really hoped that I would get a chance a dialogue chance where I could uh, side with Carlac over Will and just kill Will off, which is why I didn't give him a weapon or level him up. Alright, just keep it down. We're conspicuous enough without your hyena I don't think I've ever heard Astarian and Carlac interact before. Oh, that's unfortunate. I wanted to kill Will. God, the other, like, last stream with Will, like, disapproving of something I did while he wasn't even present, which is so fucking annoying. It's just like, come on. Oh my gosh, I agree. Survive this bug's banquet. Hmm, sounds good. I've always been curious what a patriarchal looks like. Okay. My patience waits. Mm. Everyone up the stairs. Stairs. Everyone up the stairs. We're gonna go up the stairs. Let's not get caught off guard. Alright, let's you go over there. Whole plane reeks of it. Yep, you can go over there, that's fine. That'll wake you up of a fine day, won't it? I do not need awakening. My senses are sharp as steel. Alright, you can go up here. Okay, I'm gonna try going into the front door. No, not that. Light on my feet. You're making me sweat. Okay, I want Carlac Whisper. I'm up here. I don't want her to get seen by this person. I'm kind of worried that if I yep. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna wait for her to complete her walk cycle. I'll come out here. And she'll go back inside in a second. Nice and quiet. Actually, this would be... I should actually see if she has anything to trade before I kill her. Should have worn better boots. I don't need you... Okay, you're gonna hang out... That's fine. Close the door. Attention. There. Black. Hey. Ready for some good news. Now I do need to level up Carla. Which shouldn't be too hard. Because she's a barbarian. Barbarians don't really require much. Yep, that's level two. Subclass Berserker. Except. Eight ability and strength. Let's get going. Okay. 
Let's talk to this person for a second. Here goes nothing. Let's see, what do you have? Need any supplies? We've fewer mouths to feed now. Uh. Two. Both stalwarts of Tear. Sworn to uphold. The Lord of Justice sent us after a devil. Talk to Anders if you want the details. Yeah, I already know. To recount the horror. Okay. What do you have? Image. Milf's acid arrow. First vaulting. Speed. Oh, I'll take a speed potion. That. Did everyone have a torque? Carlac doesn't. Send to Carlac. Carlac. All of them. Now for a second. Sell some crap. Oh, that was the wrong button. Oops. There, yeah, I fucked that up. Oops. No, not the grease bottles, I want those. Crossbow, bowl. Rid of all of that. Oh! Toru, VT, thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. I hope you're enjoying the stream. And welcome to our community. I'm just getting distracted here. Oh, I don't need hurts. Cool. In Tia's name. I'm probably not going to get everything when I kill her, so I wanted to uh, have a little benefit there. Okay. Here's what I'm going to do. If this isn't important. Right there on the very edge. Still in shadow. Yeah. There too. Okay. All is ash and meat. One day I'll Beth, you're going to go over there. What's cooking? Arlac, you're going to go over there and see. Turn down the fire. No one back home okay. will ever okay. believe this. I'd uh, turn based. Best get in and out. Okay, guess who I'm going to stab in the back? You. To fight. Okay, hello. Move slightly out of range. Oh. Can't be threatened. Okay. Funny action hide. Dab you again. And she's dead. Cool. Fun. And I'll get you to run that way. Cool. Now, before they get their turn. Stay out of sight. Oh, actually, this could be kind of challenging to hit him where he... Think of it. I do this without... I shouldn't have, have gone done it there. That actually was a bit dumb idea. 
Well, not a dumb idea, but it wasn't the best. Okay, let's see if I can do it. Oh! Successful hiding check. Good. Well, that was convenient and unexpected. Harlack, how well are you going to hide? See if you can succeed at a hiding check. Nope. Okay. Darian, can you succeed at a hiding check as a thief? Definitely. Oh my god, you are stupid. Okay, cunning action dash. Move you there. Right over there. Okay. Now I'm gonna have you hide. And shoot him in the ass. Cool. Survival is all that matters. You probably should have moved in a different direction. Okay, they're surprised. Now that's the jump over here. I'm gonna take an action surge just so I can finish him off. And not worry about it. Oh, never mind. This is gonna feel good. Okay. Oh, you do. Okay, hit him. Cool. And I can't equip it. It's not a good time, but I will get a cool greatsword now. That's pretty freaking good. Okay, uh, you're actually just going to go back up this way. Fortunate, but you need to go this way. Swift as my feet can carry me. No, I don't have enough movement to open the door. Okay, I'm gonna threaten her. The dance macabre. Okay. Let's have I put him back in stealth to sneak attack them. And I'm gonna have him vampire bite. Cool. Well, I managed to kill two out of three of them before they had a chance to attack me. Okay. Nice. Fuck them. Fuck Thalariel. I won't go back. I'm never going back. And if any of Mummy's little friends want to pick up where the others left off, they'll find nothing but a pile of ash. Yeah, this plays a part. Zariel's got to stop fucking with me, you know? I'm done with it. I'm done with her. I'm free. I'm free. <laughs> Can I throw, like, a carafe of water at her or something? Uh-oh. 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 Everyone together. Everyone together. Get out. Get out. Get away. <laughs> She's just going to destroy the entire place now. I don't want to be in the way. Hey, Follow her? I can't control her. Why is it... Oh. Oh, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, get out of there. No. Get out of there. Okay. Ungroup. Uh-oh. Don't attack us. Okay. No, 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 no. Out of there. Okay, no. Oh, oh boy. Everything's a little bit on fire. That's okay. 
Okay. Are you done being angry slash horny? Okay, well, I'm going to loot everything with her. Just... Just until I'm absolutely sure there's nothing else in here that will set me on fire. Okay. Oh, there is talking to be done. Must lug my guts through this hell. Let's see. What's going on, Carlac? Had to let off a little steam after facing off with those ignots. Granted the fire's lasting a little longer than it should. How do I look? Hot. <laughs> Careful, soldier. If I burn any hotter. I might explode. Hear that? Infernal engine for a heart. Let's me burn as hot as the hells. Seems to be running in overdrive since I left Avernus. Won't be seeing my mechanic anytime soon, so I'll just make the most of the extra heat. Just don't get too close till I've found a way to calm it down. A mechanic for your heart? Wild, right? And believe it or not, I'm one of Zariel's least mutilated pets. But it's a bit early in the game to be getting into tragic backstories. Let's save the Scar show for later, after we've worked up an appetite for tragedy. Meanwhile, I'll need to find someone who can tune up my engine sooner rather than later. Believe me when I say this thing is hot. The first time I faced down those paladins, they let slip there was an infernal mechanic in the area. A tiefling. He might be able to stabilize things. If His I'm name might start with a D. A weaponsmith, huh? Not sure if he's the guy, but I'd love to find out. A tune-up would do this rusty heart a world of good. Okay. What else do you what have to I say? How do you end up with such a contraption in your heart? The year, ten air. The place, a sleepy little town called Baldur's Gate. Our hero, Karlak, a knock-kneed delinquent from the outer city, with everything to give and nothing to lose. I was a kid looking for a way to fill my days and make some cash when I fell into the wrong crowd. Worked for a guy I respected. A lot. Turns out the feeling wasn't mutual. Through the jigs and the reels, he made a deal with Zariel behind my back. You know Zariel, right? Archdevil of Avernus. She put this thing in my chest and set me to work. But well, to war. I learned quick so how pretty. to stay alive. And the engine served me when it came to killing devils. Ten years of that. The stories I could tell. Mentioned a boss who gave you up to Zariel. Who was it? Guy named Gortash. Politician. Inventor. One of these wheeler dealer types who seems to have a finger in every pie. I guess I was naive to think everything he got up to was above board. What did I know? I saw a job. A good job. With people I liked. Doing work I was good at. Sometimes I'm jealous of that girl. Oh, to feel so invincible again. I've never understood the has a finger in every pie expression. Who goes around? What type of deranged psycho goes around fingering pies? Like, really? That's No one does that. God, I hope no one does that. Do people do that? Am I weird? No. Yes, but no. Not in this case. Okay. Oh, we have a lot to talk about. In the meantime, though. In the meantime. Let's go in. There you are. Okay. We have gone past one of our commercial breaks. That's unfortunate. Uh, we need to have a commercial break now, though. So, I hope everyone has had a great stream so far. We will just be gone for... About three minutes.
Good chance to get up, stretch, get some water, use the bathroom, so on. And then we'll be back very soon. There be. And we're back. Hello again, everyone. Hopefully you had a chance to... Use the washroom and such. Do what you needed to do. Hi, on. Okay. And hydrate. Hydrate is good. We have... A hydrate... That. Yes, we have a vat. I shall drink water right now. What to do? Never want okay, to so perfect. there is upstairs to this place. And a basement to this place. A loot. Get our fat loot. Where's that soul coin? What's hiding here? There it is. Don't mind if I do. Oh, that was the weird sound that we've been consistently hearing. Okay. Oh. Carlock has more to say now. Because we picked up a soul coin. What's up for discussion? So, hey, we've got this soul coin, right? Thing is, I think I can use it. My engine can, anyway. Zariel used to top me up every now and again when she wanted me to go after an especially wicked target. It was like a very quiet sound of like the sound, the souls of the damned in the background, and it was coming from the soul coin. And once I picked it up, it stopped. Got a coin slot in your heart, or what? Sort of. Next time we find ourselves toe-to-toe -to -toe with something we want to squash, drop a coin in. See what happens. Hey, uh... Intriguing. Next time we're in battle, we'll make sure you get one. Fuck yes. Now I just need something to sink my teeth into. I always forget to use them. <laughs> I'm so bad about that. It's just, I forget every single time. Come on, let's go. Uh, wish I could say I didn't, but I do. Okay. That there. All that. Nothing. Still, oh yeah, we still have a strong box. So we need to get that to someone. Right. Ship orders. Don't open the chest. Don't open this chest, or it will explode. Got it. Okay. Can't give up. Now, let us figure out what is going on in the basement. Cool. No, it's it's not a threat. Like, like it, it will blow up. Is this the message? It's like, yeah, no, this will blow up if you try to open it. So don't open it. Just save yourself the hell. The rot of death. Oh, delightful. 
Just and honestly, I don't want to open it anyways. To leave. Because it is a Zentrum K or Zentrum storage chest thing. It was a Zentrum convoy. Or Zenheritim? I don't know how to pronounce it. Uh, basically, they're they're like the thieves guild in this world, and I want to work with them in the future. So I'm going to return the crate to them, and they are going to give me a nice chunk of money for doing so. Best be on my way. Oh yeah, stole collectors that the devils murdered. All the toll stuff they've collected over time. Okay. Well, that's what the toll collector's key works for. Oh, uh, don't fail me on a perception check immediately. Starion. Your ass over here. Come on. Rest of you. Thank you. We need to, we need to detrap this area because it's very fucking trapped. Okay, good. Oh, God, why? Holy shit, that was so many failed perception checks in a row. Okay, well, I see that vent now. Can't disarm it if I can't quote-unquote see it. Okay, Astarian, can you, like, walk close enough that you can see that? That's curious. What? Oh, there's a burrow hole over there they can go through, technically. Okay, well, no one can see this vent, unfortunately. Oh, I can't disarm it. Yes, please. Oh god. Failed another perception check. I assume on the vent beside his feet. But it's so hard to see what's going on in here. I can do better. I must. Okay. Can I have some light, please? Thank you. Ooh, bars. Honey. Oh, of course you failed your perception check on that one. Come on. I need someone to see where the traps are so I can disable them. I can easily disable them. I just need someone to say, hey, there's a trap there. Don't step on it. You stepped on it, didn't you? Didn't step on it. Holy shit, I don't know how you didn't step on it. Okay, Starion? Grab whatever's in there. Uh, okay, I need the Starion out of here. Nope, 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 no, no, no. Oh. Want you on top of this... Oh, okay, just walk around then. Don't trigger the trap, whatever you... Looking ahead. Okay. This might go very badly in a second. Like for the fact that I'm standing on the trap. Okay, apparently not enough standing on the trap for it to be a problem. Good. Happy the game logic is saving my ass in this case. I don't really want the poison vents to activate if I can avoid it. Oh yeah, I haven't actually gotten rid of this one yet either. I need to be careful. This- oh fuck. How 
am I standing on the trap and it's not triggering? I'm confused. Do I not understand how these vents work? Maybe I don't understand how the vents work. Might be useful. All I know is they are dangerous. Perception check on what? What did you just see? Oh, God. Where? Okay, you do see this one. Good. Okay. Okay, you see that one too. Good. Okay. Almost stepped on it. I said... I said go to and disarm and not go to and stand on. Very hard to see down here. Would loot less stuff, but the the stuff here is genuinely valuable. A beer. 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 Back of books. Abnon. Check books. Check a crate. Okay. How much farther can I go? I'm not checking the. Don't have time. Careful. I'm okay, back. I have time, but like I just don't care. Okay, can you see some of them? No, you can't. Just don't step on the the vents then. You don't have to see the vents. You just have to not trigger them. You sit there for me, Astarian. Seems I've done something, but not enough. Hello. On my way. God damn it! All of these people suck with their perception. Hey, can you go there? Ah. Oh, I'm encumbered. Oh my god! My perception checks are atrocious. Still breathing. Why? Uh, what just happened? Are you kidding me? The rags I dropped landed on the the fucking they landed on the the plate. The, the trap plate. Yeah, Starion is like actively dying right now. Okay, I would rather can you stand on that safely? Maybe. Starion, can you get away from the all of the poison on the ground? And Lyza or uh, Kirak, you're fine. Oh, damn it. Carlac. Okay. Nope. I've got a long road ahead. Okay, I need to be careful now. Uh. Okay, now I'm just gonna have to move over here. Can you stand on top of the tables? Oh, uh, you should be able to. 
Okay, the poison has gone. That's good. At least the poison over here is gone. Disarm. I don't know if it matters now, but I'm still going to disarm it. Okay, no more poison over here. Good. Sword. Golda. Golda. I'm going to try to loot everything that's not a vase. Vases don't seem to be that valuable, but everything else is. Greater healing. Gold. Necklace. Great sword. The. The. Out of there. Great axe. Come on. Come on. Okay. Death. I'd love to, thanks. Okay, everyone's fine except for Starion, right? Proceeding. Hey, okay, you're gonna get poisoned. Sorry. Father, they would die for you. Okay. Uh, out we go, out of this room, one away, over here, one go, over here, away from the poison, one goes away from the poison, black, there. Intestines throb, blood whispers. I don't want to hear about your throbbing intestines. Oh, they're all they're encumbered, that's the problem. I don't know why she was talking weird. Okay, all of that goes to Carlac. Okay. Now I'm going to do a quick group up and then so, zone change, which moves everyone with me. Very fashionable. The under harnesses are often used for strapping oneself onto a red dragon. Fashion and function. You lot really have it all figured out. Are you giving her shit for her underwear? Seriously, Carlac? Oh my gosh. Okay. Man, Starion is not doing amazing. See if we can get a bit more money, though. Or, like, a bit more stuff done. Before we... Take short rest. So I guess there's nothing stopping me from just taking a short rest and a long rest. Or taking a long rest whenever I want. I'm just stingy with them. For some reason. Oh. Whatever whatever killed the gnomes is was the gnolls that we killed. Okay, so that's fine. We're safe enough. Let's just go this way to see if there's any herbs or Vices. Other things. Can't risk being in open view. Down here. Path lies before me. I've been down here. <clears throat> kind of. Wish I had a bag of holding. Okay. This area is clear. The next area I'm supposed to go is probably this way. This is the goblin camp over here. I think. Over here. Goblin camp over there. Okay, what's over here then? I wish we could just fast travel, but we don't have a fast travel point right now. The closest fast travel point is... There. So let us go get some more fast travel points. Hopefully there's some dark spots up here I can always room for more. Oh, not here. Try to be fairly thorough, because if you can find little places where there's chests, 
that like where there's survival spots where you can dig up chests, generally the chest rewards are worth it, so really do that. I wanna go that way. Or this way. Smoke. Something's burning. Thing is burning. Wait, is the oh, wait there's a waypoint around? Oh where it is. Okay, we can go in this door. And also try not to set ourselves on fire. That also helps. Uh, okay. We need to heal the star in a little bit. It's not loud. No, never mind. More drow. Fist! At the ready! Oh, they're racist. Okay, do I want to just attack them? Not really. Oh, can I trade with them? I can't actually trade with them. It's funny. Uh, how much would this cost? Funny that I can just trade with them when, like... All of this shit's happening. Cool. I'll take the stuff. Uh. Okay. I don't think intimidation's going to work because they already are killing Drow. Ah, uh, persuasion. To be fair, they did just get attacked by a horde of Drow, so it's not like it's completely unwarranted. They are kind of in a war. But, oh, oh, uh oh, save your breath. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, <laughs> uh oh, we don't even get like surprise or anything. We, we get truly nothing. In this fight, besides leaving, um, enemies too close, probably to Lil, I would assume. Who's gonna move first? Let's turn someone inside out. If I move Lilith, she is, I might be able to retreat from combat. Because, like, I would kind of like to retreat from combat, because this would be a pretty significant encounter to deal with without any sort of help. Like, the chance to seeth people uh, before they see me. So, let's see if I can get my people out of the way. Time. I'm gonna move you over there. I'm gonna put you in peak. I'll be fine. Damn it. Not good. Another step forward. Okay, yeah, I'm still nowhere near far enough away. Get away from the fight. Oh, they're actually leaving their post? Oh no. Didn't really want to deal with that problem. Because they're trying to rescue someone from a burning building. I would have thought that they would be more focused on that fact. But no, they're not. Uh. Hey, can I attack? Yeah, I can. Ooh, crit. Nice. Uh, how far can I jump? Handy. That way. Are they actually going to rush me? Oh my gosh, they're going to rush me. Okay, well, I mean... Fine. 
That's fine, I can deal with that. Oh. I'm not dealing with that very well. Enemies too close. Yeah, way too close. It'll be really hard for me to retreat from this. I'll threaten them, at least. I'm gonna retreat far enough away that maybe I can group them up and do something. Because currently they're all rushing around this corner. Okay, yeah, I don't think I'll be able to actually get away from them, per se, without doing something. So I'm going to hide, uh... i take her out. Okay. Still too close. Alright. We're going to go there and... Just like old times. Getting closer. Not good. Oh, good. I'm... Thank gosh I didn't get ensnared there. Okay. I am... Okay, I... If I... I, uh, I don't think I can get far enough away, because I need to move 14 feet. I have... 9 feet of movement. Wait, hold on. 18 feet of movement. I don't know if Carlock's far enough away, though. You know what, I'm gonna put acid over here. What path lies before me? Yeah, I Oh, I can flee from combat. Go to camp you're far enough from your enemy. Oh are like far enough? I kinda want to come back yeah. I... Yeah, I've never used this mechanic before. I'm gonna try to flee from combat and see what happens. Okay. Okay. We have fleed from combat successfully. Oh, what? Oh, is it per person? Oh, shit. Oh, that's not good. Um... Darian. You are too close to someone somehow. Ow. Where's the closest person? Okay, well, Lizelle's going, so I'm going to use something. Here, let's put some acid here. More acid to the party. As far as away as I can get. He can now leave. Harlac can get far enough away to leave. Astarian is hiding. Got it. I really, I I have two rogues in my party. I can't be de taking these things head on. I have to actually plan what I'm doing. Okay. Thankfully, Astarian should go next. Okay, Astarian. You should be able to just run far enough away. There. Everyone's out of combat. Okay. Oh, not that. Oh boy, that was a problem. Okay, we can try that again, but when we do that, we need to do it better this time. Can I see, like, the rest of the world, please? Oh, I'm not grouped. Oh, I am grouped, okay. Okay, no, that's not where I want. I want to be... Where were we? We're right here, so we can go to the Risen Room. 
Could uh, slowly advance on that location. Okay, so we're gonna do this differently this time. Wait, do I go up there? Yes, that is a shortcut. Okay, no one's over encumbered, right? Good. For now. Okay. This time, we are going to do this much better. Much care more carefully. I don't know where they're going to be, though. Now that they've moved, adjust to where I was. I'm going to see if I can find a waypoint near them. Securing. Theoretically, I'm pretty sure there's a waypoint around here. Where, though? I thought there was a waypoint right here. There it is. Okay. So I found the waypoint. That's good. Okay. Be the first of... Oh. Hold on. No time to rest. At the ready. Everyone together. Together now. Okay, we're gonna save. And stealth. Breathe deep and move. Okay, now we don't have people like at the very front of the courtyard. So have a better chance of actually getting around out spotted and be I'm just waiting. Oh, no, 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 no. My Go on, move. Move everything. I'd love to, thanks. Okay. Apparently that that we're still safe. Okay. I'm nothing. Move everyone closer to up again. Oh, my hand slipped. What to do? I'm gonna wait for her to turn and then shoot her in the back. Wait, am I not sneaking anymore? No, I'm still sneaking. Why don't I have advantage? Outside of normal range. Okay. There? There we go. Okay, they're poisoned. They're also surprised. Good. At the ready. Oh, there. Side. Stealth attack again. Oh, oh my gosh! And she's invisible now. Because she got a kill. Perfect. Okay, Starion. There, we solve our surprise round, so you're gonna get involved in this now. Okay. Never a dull moment. Now it's time for Lizelle to join. Light steps. Taking my cue. Do you walk up to them? Oh, that would be stupid if you walk up to them and hit them with a fucking sword, right? I hear shouting. 
someone needs help. Yeah, they are about to need help. Oh my gosh, I'm just gonna walk up to him with a sword. <laughs> wow, that was easy. Uh, okay. Oh, and I go. This is a much better way of doing this. <laughs> No stupid shit. Need to learn the hard way. Oh my gosh. Okay. How In that case. Up. How many die tomorrow? Move it. Like it's will be done. I'll move it there. Black move it here. Group. Group, group stealth, ungroup. Everyone keep positions. Okay, so there's people in here somewhere. Probably not there. Does this count as adventuring? Wanna dance? Arlock, I'm gonna move you a bit closer. And Flyzel. See what's going on. Don't waste a step. No one's over here. Stare. everyone did I give them enough time to escape Is that what happened the heat coming off of that door opening it could spell trouble okay backing up I can't sneak attack a door, I would assume. I mean, that would be stupid. Okay, I can't sneak attack a door. No time for mercy. <laughs> I had to check it. It's sturdy, so I have to do more than 10 damage to damage the. Try me. Okay, well, that's not Should working. I'm gonna walk past that for now. Broken door does not have have. Okay. Something's still on fire. Is this? Am I still in danger if I open this door? Surprised? I don't see anyone in here. That's weird. Oh, I guess the counselor that was in here burned to death. Give stuff. Greater health potion's pretty nice. Pretty hard to find those. Maybe I need more pockets. Uh, hiding around here. That's not uh, really. Oh, that fire spreading. I don't remember for sh I don't know if the fire in this room has 
I want the chest. Did I take the risk of oh risk of opening the door? Let's see what this does. Okay. Uh Save. Well, if I die, people can... Okay, good. I, I'd hope that people would... That by opening... Or... Yeah, by opening the broken door, that I would release pressure in here, and it worked. Do I have water? Yes, I have water. I'm gonna put out enough fire so I can get to the chest. That was the only thing in here? Seriously? I remember there being something better in here than. Oh, the chest. Okay. There was something better in there. The chest broke. That's what happened. Okay, time to leave. If everyone else is out of this place, then we might as well get going. Oh. Food in here. Oh my gosh, there's so much food. So much food. Okay, whatever. I don't care. Now let's loot all of the mercenaries out here. They are going to all have weapons. All those weapons are going to sell for something. Good money. Oh, I should get someone who has... Someone who has higher strength to grab things. Wait, did that... What? That goblin had a stuffed bear on them. <laughs> oh, whatever. Magic left though. The sun's too bright. So much stuff. Ah, uh, another mercenary there. What's inside? That was just less on fire. Here, quick peek. For me. Mm, no, we're good. Yeah, we lost the chance to kill a lot of those people because we left, but also we weren't really in a good position to fight. Not, not for having two robes. Lucky. Ooh. Barrels. Oh, that was full. full of food, whatever. I don't think there's anything in here. Not really. Let's see about here, though. Doesn't look like much. Yes, this is the tavern.
Oh. Hello. You spot a man crouching between the shelves, just as he spots you. Bugger! Cite the passphrase. Oh, Helm's orbs. I thought you were flaming fist. Well, down you go then. They'll be on us soon. So if you're looking to trade, you'd best be quick. Entrance is hidden behind the wardrobe. Here's the key. Wow, he's uh, the trusting sort. It would be... Why did they jump in here? Now we are in the Zentrum hideout. I mean, they're basically the Thieves Guild. Are you sad that it's just a crate? I'm sorry, Carla. The... Great cuck you. Alright, and here's the wardrobe. And in we go. Okay! There is our waypoint. We now have a merchant besides the, the... That is a welcome change. Wait, no. Oh, I should have That's far started it. Okay, I started with, business, with player character. Answer honestly and maybe we'll kill you clean. Okay. Let's see. Stealth. Flip back into the shadows. That's stupid. They know you're here. Uh, tell them the passphrase again. Door, door let you in? No. Guard at the door let you in. Down. I don't want trouble. I just want to trade. Uh, read her. Uh. Say colleague. That just tells me you've met my people. Not why you're here in their stead. Air. They won't be coming back, but I know what became of their cargo. Really? That information would be worth quite a bit to me, if you're telling the truth. We've disarmed the traps. Come down. Aha. Uh -huh. Nothing hurts anymore. Curse to put my hands on everything. Could disarm their trap still. Don't know if there's any benefit to doing that, but these boots have seen everything. Traps. How considerate. You steal anything, you're dead. Something Entire place is rigged to blow. There's no need for this. Free me now, and I'll right, let's go the see picture. that honcho. I need only tell her it's a gambling deck. It's happened before. Hmm. Let off the rest of the party. Hello, my friend. You've already brought me bad news. Tell me you've got something better this time. I can trade with her? I 
could drain all of her money by adding my wares. That actually sounds like a good idea. Why not? I don't need any of this shit. That was another 140. Okay, she does not have enough to map all of that. Gets gemstone I added. I added a gem. Oh, okay. What does that have? Let's put the heavy things in. Okay. Uh, I'm still over by... Yeah. Got some of the... They don't weigh a huge amount. Put in... Oh. Okay, barter. Cool. They caught me a lot of good shit. Sure. Oh, good. Okay, well, she now is only crap. <laughs> I don't intend to ever kill her, so... I'm gonna give her the chest. Hopefully this will result in me getting Shabbos benefits. Black bones, you did it. And still sealed. You're a god's damn wonder. Here's your coin. I want to have this contact. Professionals are rare. You ever want more work? Come and see me in the gate. That's why I've been nice to her. Some of our more exotic items now. But don't delay. This place is likely to be rubble soon. Someone kidnapped a duke, right on our bloody doorstep. The Flaming Fist will need someone to blame. I don't plan on it being us. Fair enough. Okay. Ooh, and we got Harold, a heavy crossbow. When you deal damage to a target with, do you, when you deal damage to a target with a ranged weapon, it must succeed a charisma. Oh, the target must succeed a charisma saving throw, or be baned. So they have 1d4 less r less to their attack rolls and saving throws. So it actually is a pretty nice benefit. I can give that to Lizelle immediately. She used heavy crossbows. Did that not work? Where did that just go? My gosh. There it is. Oh, Arlac, you can have this one. Okay. By type. In order. And the inventories are a mess, though. I'll have to go through them and, like, actually figure all that shit out eventually. I have 20 potions on the character. For... It's not how this should be. <laughs> Uh, open a few things. I'm opening all the books that I find just because sometimes my characters will be like, hey, that t reminds me of this time when I did this thing, and you'll find interesting information. Okay. You don't want to keep. What? Don't touch anything. You ain't. Uh, sure. Well, oh, you're the traitor. Don't. If you have the gold, my pet artist will make you a most heroical likeness. No oh, thanks. Just want to trade. Got some interesting stock for a friend of the family. Okay. 
that goes in there. Uh, so keep the metallic gloves out. Now I might need them. Relax, you have gloves on? I no gloves on. Everyone has gloves on. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Please don't do this stuff. Okay. Okay, that's 350 gold worth of shit out of my inventory. Now, what do they have that could potentially be gloves of thievery? Okay. And a slate of hand checks sounds nice. I'm using the missile snaring gloves currently. Yeah. Darian, you have on hit with a weapon attack, possibly inflict a 1d4 penalty to attack rolls and saving throws. Plus one to sleight of hand. I think I need that. Hail of Thorns, you get Hail of Thorns. What a charm. Attack skill. Don't really need it. Nice piece of armor there that I should probably buy for Karlak. Lots of good stuff. That for Carlac. No, oh, not Lizelle. Heck. Cool, that gives her an extra five AC. <laughs> Big deal. Okay, no one needs gloves. Chest. Well. 12, AC 12, 13, medium. Rogues can only do light armor. 12. I need boots and hats mostly. Titan string bow. This weapon deals additional damage equal to your strength modifier. That would be really good for okay, Kirak specific. Or, damn it. Parlax specifically. But she does have something that's good already. So her strength modifier is like plus four. That would be 1d8 plus six instead of 1d10 plus two. That actually would be better. 800, that's lots of money. I'm not running out of money anytime soon. Giant Breaker, your weapon hits hard enough to send your target reeling for two turns. They have minus one to attack rolls. Okay. Oh, dagger. I need a dagger for Starion. Good. Put your weapon in this oil. It receives minus one to spell attack rolls and spell saves. I've never seen that item before. It's going in my inventory. I think that's good. Oh. Alchemist fire is pretty deep. I'll buy some of them. Oh, balance offer. It's like, it, sure, this shitty shirt and 100 gold's enough. No, it's not. Okay, I think I'm good. I don't need. Should be good. I don't need anyone. I'll leave the scimitar. Am I really going to use the go crazy mace for anything? I'm not. I really am not. Okay. Arlac has a great bow for her now. And Starion finally has a plus one dagger. And yeah. That. I have the Wizard's Bane. Awesome. I have a 
great axe that I probably am not going to use, but I'll hold on to it. Okay, cool. Pleasure. This has been very productive. Uh, and then we have Alas, time random person. Time. You, the way you handled Zaris, you're not one of her fucks. You need to buy me. Why? I don't need a servant. Then it is well I am asking you to serve only yourself. For the return of her prize artist, my patron will measure her gratitude in gold. Tenfold whatever ransom these clots try to squeeze from you, I guarantee it. Who's your patron? As far as you're concerned, she may as well be the coin maiden herself. No, that's sketchy. Time for questions later. Please, speak to Brem. I need to see the sun again. No, I'm good. Oh, no, no, no. Don't do that. Just talk to this person. You look like a bird than a me to have. Glad I won't have to find out. I want your armor. Oxen recipe. I can read this without getting in trouble. Oh, I guess I already have the toxin recipe. Hey, I'm not going to fuck around with any of the stuff in their base because that would be really stupid. Do you trade? No. Hold on. Flaming fist crawling about. No. Okay. I think we're good here. I don't really want to mess with these guys because they're. Professional criminals, basically. And I mean, I guess I'm a professional murderer, but... Or Lilith is. Gotta stop saying uh, saying it as if I'm I'm the one. Build my castle with bones. I definitely am not. Help Oscar escape. No. Viable shipment. I already did that. I don't... Hey. Emerald Grove. Let's go back here for a second. Take stock of what's actually going on. Hey. So we have the Gith Yankee Patrol right here. I think that's a... Probably be a good place to end the stream. There. So let's go do that right now. We'll figure out... Uh, what is going on. I think. Oh. I'll take that. Boop, 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 what? My kin are near. Hmm? Oh, huge. there's a dragon ahead of us. Above us. Stay low. It might not see us. Somewhere. <laughs> it's kind of silly because, like, you don't actually see the dragon, and like outside of the cutscene. So, like, just like, ah, there's a dragon somewhere. Anything of use? Yes. What are you doing? What's going Drop on? Your weapons. I'll feed your innards to the ants before I do that to Istic. This is your last chance. No, look up. That was your last chance, Istic. Now burn. Pretty. Well, that's where all the flaming fist went that tried that tried to escape from burning building. I don't know who they actually are. What they do? Stop wasting time, Beretta. You're not here to play with the locals. Of course, Kithrak. We merely sought to. No excuses. Question, kill, then move on. Find the weapon. Our queen watches us. 
Fail her at your peril. A red dragon. I envy its night. Would that I rode such a steed. A crash must be near. Come, my kin await. Hmm. Uh, and we'll just pat the dragon on, on the head, I suppose. The dragons serve Githyanki. I'll see it does you no harm. Follow me. Okay. We are close to the cure we seek. Okay. Okay. What did I last say? Oh, good. It already... I like how the dragon just popped in there. Rider, my time is short. Lead me to... Shh, shh, shh. Such a familiar tone. Were I not merciful, I would slice the skin clean from your meat. So they're all assholes. Yet you are not bleeding. For I am nothing if not merciful. Your name, child. I shouldn't be speaking Lazel. here. Lazel. Proud, regal, even. You will call me Gestil Kithrak. Vos, Knight Supreme, the Queen's Silver, the Queen's Sword. I am who you say. A Geek vessel has fallen from the sky, Lazel. Thieves aboard have taken a weapon most precious. It is polyhedric in shape and inscribed with the sacred runes of our people. You suddenly feel a strange anxiety take hold. Not your own, but that of the artifact you carry. Somehow, it's afraid you attune your mind to it. The artifact does not want to part from you. It does not want to fall into the Gith Raider's hands. This is Take the artifact that crash. Shadowheart's holding. You are to join our search. Speak up, child. Affirm your mandate. Hmm. I'm not going to do that. Uh, I'm not going to fight them with a level 10, 400 health dragon beside them. Persuasion. Melth a command to play along. Don't want to die. You honor me with this duty, Kithrak. I shall alert my caretaker with haste. The Kithrak nods. Content with Lazel's answer. You serve your queen well, child. Take your slaves and hunt those who escaped the Geich ship. They must carry the weapon. I fly now to Vlakith, our undying queen. She will see your faith rewarded in this plane and ours. A current of deception carries Voss's words. Wherever he flies, it is not to Vlakith. To Danos! To the sky! Why don't we just get a Starium close-up? What's that for? What, what was that for? Oh, he's inspired. For some reason. You did well to intervene. Vexed as I am to admit it. The distilled Kithrak would have flayed our skin and left our carcasses to burn in the sun. Good thing she kept us safe. sake of the artifact that we carry. The crash is near, this much we know. We follow the path forward and into the valley. No one, not even the ignobles just still Kithrak, will keep me from my purification. Okay. Have I been this Nothing way? will keep me from looting all these people. Of their loot. Yay, stuff! Gosh, I have too. I just perpetually have too much stuff on me. Wait. 
Why do I have duplicate stuff? Weird. Shadow heart or something? Okay, well that's where I've been putting all of my... My potions are but not necessarily going to help me. I just have too much food on me? Camp. Oh, that was a good portion of eight. You get a pet dragon. I have no idea. I would love one. But no, I have no idea. I, I mean, I've only finished Act... The farthest I've gotten is finishing Act 1 so far. So... I haven't actually gone all that far in this game yet. There's still lots and lots and lots to do. I don't even need that. All of that. Add to where's, and I will send it over to Lizelle. Onto that for now. I would love a pet dragon. Oh. irresistible. You recognize the overwhelming authority that you've used on others, only infinitely stronger. Your vision clouds, leaving you in a dark, featureless shadowscape, nothingness in every direction. Then there are three figures before you, an armored male elf exuding power and command, a handsome younger man with a quick, easy smile, and a pale young woman with even paler eyes. Yeah, like, I've never met any of these people or know who they are. Like, that's how how far I've not gone in this game. Aid their search for the weapon, and you will be worthy to stand beside them in my presence. So I'm pretty sure when they say weapon, they're talking about the artifact. As a strange energy swells around you. The many-sided artifact. Somehow you understand it's repelling the presence. A very cool die. My power grows. My forces gather. The reckoning draws near. The voice is quelled. The artifact's doing. That voice, those visions, what just happened? No answer presents itself. The artifact is dormant. The voice and visions are gone. All there's left is the the voice in my head telling me to kill. I think that must have acted to Area but to enter will be bitterly difficult for a party of your level. Oh, okay, so that's that is the next area. Or like the next act over there. But we'd be best not to go there. I think there might be some sort of I think there might be a waypoint around. Maybe not. More for me. We'll loot the stuff though. Yeah, that's good. Okay. Oh, cool. Okay. 
Okay, I think it is time that we end the day. Game. Must lug my guts through this hell. Eager for battle. Okay. Go to camp. We're out of short rests, so be a good time. We probably could fight more, but I don't think that's for the best. I have a lot on my mind. And well, in it. What is Will doing over here? He has thoughts and continues to live, despite my better judgment. You've been witness to a pantomime, I'm sorry to say. And I've played my part all too poorly. Oh, him chasing Carlac. Uh. What's so useful to drive a dagger through your skull? No, I don't want to tell him that, because when I do that, I want to be a surprise. <laughs> Hmm. What's that supposed to mean? It means that a reckoning's coming. And I'll be the one to pay up. One night soon when we make camp, the veil will be lifted, and I'll pay my penance. Should I be worried? You're not in any danger, I promise. I can't say the same about me. The Gith Knight is as merciless as the dragon he rides. That we still have our heads is nothing short of You weren't of there! Okay, whatever. That doof can stay in camp forever. As far as I'm... I don't know who I'm going to take with me in the future, because I, pro I probably shouldn't have both Karlak and Lysel. I'll probably swap one of them for... Shadow Heart. I'm not very familiar with having Lysel. Usually I have Karlak with me. So it might be kind of worth it to stick with Lysel just so that I have, I don't know, experience doing new things. It seems the Githyanki are keen to reclaim the artifact I carry. In fact, none of us can. That thing is shielding us somehow. I don't want to know what happens if we lose it. Let's not find out. We already have enough to contend with. Agreed. There's not much we can do but press forward. True. Something strange happened. That artifact you carry it just seemed to come to me. I know. I felt it. Felt it what? Fly away from you? Yes. No. I don't know. The artifact seems to have powers, and a will of its own. It protects us. I don't know how or why, but I'm glad. I felt it go from me to you. You need its help, just as it needs us. It's still just a box, after all. <laughs> Suppose you want it back. Might not be possible. It's stubborn that way. Prone to lashing out. Keep it for now. We can all help to protect it. Yeah, we'll we'll see Han when we end up with ultimately. But now I think Something I'm going better. to send Carlac back to camp. Things are looking wonderful. Hey, cool. What are we doing anyways? Ooh, we're getting close to leveling. I think we're gonna hit level five, and we have—we still haven't even gone to the goblin camp yet. Oh, uh, which is like one of the main points of this act. Okay, now that all this is done, though, let's end the day. Oh. heavy. Moisture drips down your forehead. Pain shoots through your fingers. Ah.
Spread, spread that. Wipe the sweat from your brow, I guess. Your hands shake as they reach upward. Your forehead remains drenched, no matter how much you wipe. Can you feel it crawling through you? Tendrils squirming in your chest, gripping your heart, piercing your belly. Your bones popping, your flesh swelling. I can. I see it in you. I feel it in me. We are lost. I will be quick with my blade. First you, then the others, then myself. Your minds intertwine. You sense a touch of uncertainty. You have a weird a way of coming on to me. Disgust. Okay. Okay, medicine. I have advantage, apparently. Perception. Let me see how far far gone you are. Give me the blade, I'll make it quick. No, I don't want to kill her. I don't want to die either. I don't want to kill her. Uh, persuasion, we're just exhausted. Lower the blade before you do something foolish. Explore her mind. Oh, I want to persuade her. Yay, not 20. I cannot trust my own mind. So it seems I must trust yours. I will wait. But know this. I am watching. If the sickness does not pass come dawn, I will end us all. Her ears remind me of aloe. They're like kind of spiky. Oh, more things are happening. Oh, so this is my guardian. <laughs> I came just in time. You are transforming. Ah, oh, yes, she was the one who was like, I don't fucking know who you are. I don't know if I if I even want to design you, so I'm just going to put a beard on you and leave. <laughs> oh, wonderful. Okay. Are you the evil inside my brain, the dark compulsion? Don't worry. You will not become a mind flayer. Not while I'm around. I'll protect you. Oh, God! Mmm. <laughs> because if I start imagining things... I have, I have to, I have to, I have to. Though the thought crosses your mind, it doesn't hold you, doesn't devour you, as your thoughts too often can. Your compulsions will doom us all, if you do not work to stop them. I can help. closely there is great potential within you it comes from that parasite your instinct is to resist the power it gives but you must accept it nurture it I will keep it from consuming you but for the sake of both of us you must learn to wield it Very cool environment. A fight for the fate of Faerun. A fight we are losing. For now. You can change that, but only if you embrace your potential. <laughs> she has very crazy eyes. I have to go. 
The enemy is closing in. I will be back. So we're being protected from undergoing seramorphosis, which is turning into a mind flare. And we're being protected from the mind flare's mind control by the artifact. Okay, who should I talk to? We'll go talk to Astarian. I had the strangest dream last night. There was a visitor promising me protection and all sorts of delicious powers from the parasites in our heads. Given our shared affliction, I suppose you had a similar dream. Mm hmm. I did. Excellent. Now we can see what these tadpoles can do for us. We should take every advantage we can get. Let's explore these powers and see where they take us. Exactly. Waste not, want not. Even when it comes to mind flare parasites. Might as well use the power while we have it. Oh my gosh. A lot of stuff. Okay, we're we're gonna put we're gonna put a pin in a lot of that. There there is talking to be had here, but for now, oh, Arlek took over some of some of my circle. He very carefully made this blood circle out of Alf Alfira's blood, very much. Okay. Thank you all for watching today. It is time for us to end the stream. I appreciate all of you here. For those who are on YouTube, a like, comment, and subscribe. And I appreciate seeing you in the next video. Uh, this will be going up on at Black Cat Streams tomorrow. And while they the videos haven't been going up yet. I do intend to put up the Baldur's Gate replay through cut up eventually on at Black Cat Studio. Our next stream will be on Tuesday as we stream Tuesday, Thursday at 2.30 p.m. PST, 5.30 p.m. EST. Thank you all so much for watching today. I hope you have a great weekend and may it be filled with lots and lots of blood. Well, maybe we shouldn't murder people. Don't murder anyone. I'm a bad influence. Bye! Very welcome, Han.